Hello again, Roy Zestot Realtor here with Coldwell Biker Legacy in San Angelo. Today I'm going to continue my series on the counties around the Concho Valley and we'll talk about Schlacker County. Schlacker County has three-ish communities in it, depending on how you define that term. El Dorado is really the only town of any, any consequence with schools and stuff. There's Holdale and Adams, which are both virtually non-existent in today's world. So there's one town you know, on 277 between San Angelo and, and Sonora. So the topography is not a lot of variation in it. It kind of builds up from a, a low there around Holdale and kind of goes up a little bit through El Dorado to what they call the divide south of El Dorado. And from there toward the Sutton County line, it falls off pretty good. There's some, some bigger canyons and stuff like that. You start to get into a lot of cedar, a lot of broken limestone type stuff in that area. Uh, there's the northern end, you tend to have a good bit of cedar in that area, and then a lot of mesquite flats and those kind of things in different parts. There's some, some variances in it, but not huge amounts. It tends to be fairly open country, not a lot of, of big elevation changes or anything like that. It uh, got to be a little famous a few years ago when the, the Yearning for Zion Ranch the, by the fundamentalist LDS group had, had sent down, well, had lived, bought that and developed that and had some amazing buildings and whatnot on their ranch. We're d doing a lot of stuff, had a lot of people living there. And then due to some child issues, they were raided by the state and, and pretty well they basically decided to leave and I believe it's still actually for sale. If you're interested in it, the, the state was trying to sell it a few years ago. I think it's still in that process. So it's kind of a, an interesting location, a little bit of interesting history there in, in Schlacker County. Uh, water, there's not a lot of water in, as far as surface type water in Schleicher County. You do get a little bit, the, the San Saba River technically starts in Schleicher County, but most of what is the San Saba, becomes the San Saba River further east is pretty well dry still in Schleicher County. Toenail Trail going out through that way, it's, it's pretty open. Uh, a lot of limestone, a lot of shallow soils, and uh, underground water wells and stuff like that. Can, there's a lot of variation. You just want to be careful making sure if you need water when you go to buy a place that, that it is available there because there's, there's places it is and places it isn't. You have to be cautious about that and consider how important that is to your plans. The land's not terribly expensive. The proximity to Angelo is a little bit farther away, which, which lowers the prices. Uh, a lot of hunting properties, some smaller ones, and even some bigger ones that, that come up for sale periodically around there. So, some variants and stuff. It's a nice, nice little place, not very populated. There's about 3,500 people total in Schleicher County, so it's it's pretty low population level. You're not going to get too crowded. So, if that's something you're looking for, then give me a call. We'll discuss it. Roy's Estate Realtor, 325-268-0775. Thank you.